This is Ex Anima, an incredibly unique physics-based dungeon crawler that went into early access in 2015, and it'll probably never come out of it. But despite it being a glorified tech demo, the incredibly goofy physics-based gameplay makes it one of the most fun and unique experiences I've had in quite a while. You know when babies are first learning to walk, but they haven't quite figured it out yet? It's kind of like that. <gasps> Oh dude, don't trip over, don't trip over, get up, get up! I decided to go in completely blind, because tutorials are for losers. First task is to pick up this torch. How do I do that? Pick it, hold it, grab it. Did you read the tutorials? Absolutely not. And thanks to that decision, my first run went about as well as you'd expect. Are you mad? Always, oh, yep, a little bit. Was that my fault? Oh shit! He's coming after me! You're fucking getting it now, son. Oh shit! Ah! Yeah, that's right. Get fucking owned, bitch. Oh fuck! Ah! No! Oh no! Ow! Dude, this. God, oh please. Woohoo! Help me! <laughs> yes! Fuck you! Ah! No, I'm dead! <laughs> oh! I'm not dead! Now I'm dead! <laughs> what? He's kicking me while I'm down, man. Again? He's gonna get me again. <laughs> and so, after that came to a pretty quick end, my second run started very similarly. Oh, fuck. Yes! Fuck you! Oh no 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 please 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 get fucking chopped son Oh Oh Yeah get chopped Alright he he donked me on the head a few times but we chopped him After stumbling my way through the dungeon for a little while I came across something Or should I say someone It was a man named Shaggy well, his actual name was Darren, but I mean, look at him. It's literally Shaggy. Maybe we can get out together. Oh my god, we get a guy? Yes. Dude, he's gonna get fucking owned. He's gonna, he's gonna get his head cut off. <laughs> Zoink Scoob, I'm, I'm in a scary dungeon filled with ghouls. Waistcoat, boots. Yeah, Shaggy looking dripped. I really did think Shaggy was gonna immediately die, but as it turned out, he was instrumental in keeping me alive. This will be a test of Shaggy's skill. All right, Shaggy, fucking fuck him up. Oh, oh yes! Oh shit! Out! Oh no! Get him, Shaggy! I'm nearly dead. It's all on you. Yes! <laughs> Oh, he's, he's, he's fucking incredible. Immediately, I started taking advantage of Shaggy. I was using him as a shield any chance I got. Yeah, dodge. Yeah, that's right. No! <laughs> Shaggy, I can't. Shaggy, it's a really thin corridor. Shaggy, fucking hit him. Okay, I can help. Yes, he did it. He got him. I didn't help at all. Ah, it was the fucking shitter. I didn't even need to come in this room. Oh, no. How are you doing? He says he's good. If he dies, I'm gonna be fucking distraught. I'm more more worried about Shaggy's life than I am my own. I ignoring the fact that I send him at every enemy like my little minion. <laughs> Get him, Shaggy. Get him, Shaggy. Shaggy? Shaggy's waiting for my instruction. He's like, yeah, you haven't done shit, man. Oh yeah, here we go, here we go. Oh no. Oh, yes, Shaggy! Look at the blood on Shaggy's axe. He's murderous. That was Malia. Oh, uh, what do you mean? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. In my apathy, I'd forced Shaggy to kill one of his friends. Someone who I can only assume is another member of the Mystery Inc. gang. In response to what I'd done, Shaggy retaliated. No! Oh, he hit me! Oh, Shaggy, no! 
Oh god, I'm, oh, I'm falling over. However, luckily for me, I think being clonked over the head a bunch of times made Shaggy immediately forget any of his problems. How are you doing? He's still good. I don't know how. And then it was right back to doing the heavy lifting and saving my life once again. <laughs> when Shaggy sees red, you better move away, yeah. He's fucking, he's scary. Uh-oh. Here we go, speaking of. Move away, move away, move away. Ugh. Oh no, I fell over! Oh god! <laughs> no, get him Shaggy, please! <laughs> Shaggy, get him! Ugh. Okay, he did it. He did it. I knew I shouldn't have tried to help. I knew I shouldn't have tried. I should have just let him do his thing. It's me and Shaggy versus the world. I don't know if we can do it. We're gonna try our goddamn best. After all of the fighting, Shaggy and I faced a new challenge. A puzzle section that consisted of levers and traps that would send you plummeting to your death. Oh, 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 uh, <laughs> oh, dude, no, what if Shaggy falls? I, I will, I cannot live with myself if he falls. Get ready, Shaggy. Go, 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 go. Oh. No! <sighs> oh, God. That was close. Oh, no, I have to get across all three in one go. Are you serious? It was at this point that I was informed that this path was entirely optional and the only thing I'd get at the end is a bit of extra loot. This is where, if I really cared, I would have turned back. But no matter how many times he saved my life, I never truly appreciated Shaggy. I think I'm gonna do it. I wanna try. All right. Book it. Shaggy, come on! No! <laughs> you stupid bitch, Shaggy! Oh, come on, man. You could run faster than that. This was my fault. I did that to him. How am I gonna live with myself now? Oh. You know what they say, you don't know what you've got till it's gone. And Shaggy was definitely gone, at the bottom of a deep, dark pit. I have to get to the end of whatever this is, to honor his memory. I know I can't make it. I can't escape here without him. I'm too low health, but I can try my goddamn hardest. Oh, <laughs> God, it's like I'm tripping over my untied shoelaces. Shortly after, I got to the first loot room, and I've got to tell ya, it didn't feel good to be rewarded for killing my friend. And what do we got? Some hardened spaulders. All that. I got Shaggy killed for some hardened spaulders? Fuck. Damn it, man. It wasn't worth it. I gave up the life of a man for some shoulder pads. Shaggy was good and all, but damn, Harden Spaulders. No, we can't forget about him that quickly. Just throw his memory away for a piece of armor. After genuinely another hour of trying to get through the maze, I finally made it to the end. And with that, the story of Shaggy comes to a close. I truly would not have made it to the end of this level without him. And for that, may he live forever, in our hearts and our minds. This was for you, Shaggy. I will remember you. I did it all for you. Will you? We'll always remember you. Don't let your 